I'll demonstrate how it seemingly defies the current accepted view of the nature of the universe. All I do is charge the device, fill the, iron, fill the iron core with north and south pole individual magnetic currents that will indeed circulate indefinitely. And let me first charge the uh, device. Pretty good charge. And take note of the uh, intensity of the light that you'll see in the flash. And um, actually, this can sit indefinitely. And if I was to pull this the top bar off at this very moment, you would see the same intensity in that light bulb as if I was to pull it off six months from now. And so uh, that shows that during that entire amount of time, it lost no light. It, if, it, if the intensity of the light did not diminish from the first time when you pulled that bar off, then it shows that it, it held its strength for that six month period. And so for now, uh, let me first just show you that I'm going to easily pick this up. It's a fairly good bond. You can see how kind of tight it is right there. So, watch the light bulb. And in fact, you may not even be able to see the light bulb, but you'll be able to see the flash of light. Um, so, according to Ed Leeds Coleman, and it's fairly clear that there was a perpetually circulating current when you broke the orbit, or when I broke the orbit, uh, some of the magnets few of them went back through the coil and back through the light and uh, obviously left the light bulb. Those currents that were circulating 